All right, so we've got a SAT math problem here. So it says in the expression 3 times 2x squared plus px plus 8 minus 16x times p plus 4. p is a constant. This expression is equivalent to the expression 6x squared minus 455x plus 24. What is the value of p? So here we have two missing variables in this one equation. Um, so that is going to make it a little bit tricky to solve. But the thing to notice here is that um, p is only in the values of x. So what I mean by that is you can see 3 times px, right? That's going to give you 3px. Um, and then over here you have negative 16x times p. That's negative 16px, right? So that is all under the same x term. Um, if we look over here, that means it's only going to affect this term right here, negative 155x. Because p can be anything and it won't affect the 6x squared or the plus 24 constant. All right, so let's set up our uh, equivalent equation because it says this expression is equivalent to the expression. Therefore, we can uh, set up that equation, isolate for p, and we'll be good to go. So 3 times px is just 3p, and I'm going to negate the x's for each of them because x is in each of these equations, and it's just a substitute variable. So we can just negate that. Over here, we have negative 16x times p, so just negative 16p. I almost forgot the plus 4, so p plus 4. And that is all equivalent to, we're negating the x, so that's just negative 155. All right, let's just do some distributive property. So negative 16 times p, negative 16p. Oopsies, okay. All right, negative 16 times uh, positive 4 is just negative 64. And then we have 3p on this side. And this is equivalent to negative 155. And let's just do some simple algebra, right? We add 64 on both sides. Do, do, do. And that will give us 91 on this side. And so now we're left with 3p minus 16p on the left side. And that will give us negative 13p. All right. And we can divide by negative 13. Boom. Boom. Oh, I actually made a mistake here. It's negative 91. That makes sense because a negative over a negative. So negative 91 divided by negative 13 gives us P is equivalent to 7. All right. So our answer choice is B.